Right, I've got a Maytag Legacy Series washer. It is a super size capacity. It is a huge capacity. No problem washing uh, some pretty good sized blankets and comforters in there. And what I want to do is just show you that it does, in fact, work like it's supposed to. So, you know, we're just going to set it on medium and uh, warm, cold. We'll just go over here to regular. So I can show you that. Water works like it's supposed to. It's nice warm water. Water works, and then, uh, yeah, let's see. Spin cycle is the other super important thing. That way you can see that the drain kicks in and it's running that water out. You get to listen to it as it speeds up here. It's nice and quiet, smooth. Let me turn this dryer off. Open that real quick. Lid switch works perfect. It's got a good brake on there. And I just put a load through the washer. And it is in the dryer, so I will show you that here in just a sec. Anyway, that's that. Works perfect. It's got a it'll shut off here, and then if you turn the extra rinse on, it goes through that extra rinse cycle too. So and then spins out at the very end. The clothes came out nice and light. And then we transferred them over to the dryer. Excuse my mess here, but like I said, I just want you to see that it does, in fact, everything works like it should. It's nice and hot in here. And I've got my temperature gun. I'll show you outside temperature. About, yeah, about 90 degrees. That sounds about right. It's a little warm. Outside temperature of the washer. Yeah, it's about 70 down here. So inside, that old tube is where the actual heat comes out. So that'll get up pretty hot. But then the inside temperature of your dryer is going to range anywhere from 150 to 200 degrees. Just kind of depends. The clothes themselves, I mean, it all gets pretty warm. So you can see it's nice and hot in there. As it tumbles around, that's going to be pretty hot because of the heating element. But the actual inside temperature is going to be right up in here. And allows these clothes to get nice and dry very quickly. And right now I've got it on the auto sensing. So I'll just show you here. Temperature set to regular. Extended tumbles on. That's for wrinkles and stuff. And then I've got it on the auto sensing mode. And it's running great there. Like I said, nice and hot. And it knows when the uh, clothes are... Um, about dry and it kind of does its own thing so as it gets over here to less dry and then it cools down then it shuts off of course you could also do wrinkle control where your clothes won't get wrinkly because it kind of turns on shuts off for a while turns back on shuts off and it's a it's a whole 30 minute process or good old time dry if you ever get a huge load in there you can start out at 100 you know 60 minutes or even 40 minutes most of the time will get it for you but uh and you can listen to that it's nice and quiet, nice and stable, it's not jumping around and sounds good. So both of these are in excellent shape. And like I said, I just wanted this video to be here to show you that they do work perfectly. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask. We'll get these listed up for sale and I appreciate you taking the time to watch my video. Thanks.